That's a really interesting stack of tires. Nah, I'm kidding. Anyways, here's the progress on the A. Dad did a lot of work on it while I've just been goofing off with dumb other projects and just getting the house cleaned up because I've just been working a lot. But uh, yeah, basically the this little angle iron up here is part of a bed frame that was also used as a support of some kind for the like snowblower back up when I just cut the wheel horse. I ended up getting the correct bracket on and took off this weird like bed frame piece I was tacked on and finally used it about three years later. That whole metal sheet there came from the Dodge Ram door panel that I took off of the junk door that came off of the truck. So yeah, recycling and it's finest. I'm, yeah. So we're going to be coming up from the bottom corner here of where the angle iron is and just in front of that is where our actual firewall will bolt up to where I step back the entire front of the gas tank. And once we get to that, pretty much the cows ready to go. I'm going to be like layering in like a floor pan after all the rest or lower structure is put together. But for now, it's pretty solid. If I pick up on this side of the car, it pretty much doesn't want to give. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, I'm pretty happy with how this is going. I'm going to be taking another 3 8 off of the lower lower half of the grill shell there just to try and get the angle of it. It's still downhill of where the cowl is but it could be more and I like the idea of it being more low. So we're going to be doing that. I have the room to clear the air cleaner, just all, everything will clear nicely. So going to do that might end up being more than 3 8 still and going from that, not a whole lot going on. Well, well the rest of the car really. Festiva, I did an oil change and that's a whole lot of, that's basically it. Just kind of kept it around in the garage since I don't really feel like driving it because the weather's been kind of iffy. So going from here, here's the pebble. I put the Miata wheels on. Everybody wants, like, they must be using gold weights nowadays to just balance these wheels and tires because they want like 60 bucks anywhere you go. And the one shop I like to go to is closed on the weekends. He charges about like 20 bucks for a set of wheels. So I'm just going to be stuck driving this in on Monday after work. But for now, Miata wheels on it look fantastic. And this is part of an antenna dish like mount. So I hammered it back out to round. And we're going to use that to section in where I've basically bent the exhaust back where it belongs, but there's part of the exhaust that has just rusted out and broke away. So that's what this or this is going to fix. So do, 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 there we go. See? There we go. So going to pick that back up. This has already been test fitted on there a few times. I'm just going to be well, got it close enough. I'm gonna fire up the welder, get this cylinder into place tack it into place, and then I'm going to be hanging out to a car meet that's the last one of the year. So yeah, a bunch of fun stuff. Figured I'd give you guys an update with just general shop stuff other than the truck. I haven't really done anything with it other than picked up a few things, and the taillight has a stupid light out signal thing going on still. And the last thing that can really go or be fixed with it is literally tracing the six wires from the taillight all the way to the brake or brake switch in the cab typical dodge issues so yeah i'm gonna get off here get this on head out to the car meet for the end of the year see you guys okay i know my one friend's here just don't know where Guy has to win for having candy. <laughs> Car is too loud. I had to turn it down. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll put it in half. see the boat again. So I cut the grill shell down another 3 eighths of an inch and got the hood propped up a closer to where it will actually fit on the hood or grill shell I should say. 
it's still raked down a fair amount, but I can still bring it down probably another, oh, probably 7 sixteenths, roughly. And roughed out the plate for the passenger side of the frame. This one I still got to grind down the rough well because I was dialing it in. And basically get that side done. And since it's Halloween, I'm going to put a metric part on this car.